Uh, good morning, and uh, uh, I'm very happy to be here today. And Bangladesh, you know, the one of the the biggest player in the international apparel market. We are uh, the second largest uh, next to China, but the gap is still very huge. And my dream is always to be the number one in the apparel sector. So, and that is the target. I think of the whole industry is uh, working for or looking for. So. It would not be very quick. It would not be very easy, but we are we are having the goal to be the number one in next ten years, fifteen years, whatever it uh, it requires. So we are looking very positively, and uh, and we had uh, some turbulent time uh, recent past in because uh, uh, the economic situation in, in in our market market area like uh, Western world in Europe in uh, in North America was not that much uh, comfortable. So. But that days, I think, uh, is over now. So we are again looking forward to uh, grow with our uh, uh, steady speed we had for the last two, three decades. Uh, Plummy Fashions, the, the unique part of uh, this factory is we, we claim that uh, this is the most uh, environment-friendly composite knitwear factory in the world. We are certified by e UAGBC and the Elite Platinum certification we have. So and it is one of the most beautiful factory and we, we produce all kind of circular knitted products. We, we export our products mainly to North America and uh, Europe, but apart from that, we also have some, some sort of uh, export to Southeast Asia and uh, South America. And we are also looking for the expansion and growing the business further. Yeah, I think the Africa. We we, we look Africa in, in from different perspectives. Some, you know, as an exporter, sometimes we 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 look for our opportunity to to grow our market there. Sometimes we we feel they are our competitor, and sometimes we also feel there is opportunity to uh, grow together with Africa. And maybe the third option could be the the best option because African countries. Uh, um, what I, I followed last two and a half decades in particular, uh, they are uh, trying to move uh, forward, but uh, apart from agua benefit, they could not do that much, uh, if I am not wrong, it is my personal perception. And Ghana, uh, to me, is a new country in this field. So I never heard that much about Ghana in compared to few other uh, African countries and I was uh, just having uh, the uh, uh, a little chat with the consultant of this project and he agreed that and that's why Ghana became very serious and I love to see that the Ghana became very serious and very happy to know the Ghana is very safe country in compared to few other uh, neighboring African countries and uh, laborers are English speaking hard working and labor rates are not that much high it is more or less maybe like Bangladeshi so I think there is a lot of opportunities uh, uh, from the perspective of growing together and that certainly uh, we if there is an opportunity we can explore that as well yeah I think I think that should be the beginning because uh, knowing first because investment decision would not come tomorrow no, and with one seminar I think nobody will uh, take decision for for investment uh, in, in other country it should take time so we should know each other very well yeah. and uh, it is not only one sided that bangladesh trade mission should go to ghana but uh, apart from that i think regular, regular. Uh, information exchange and uh, uh, experience sharing also very much uh, required to move forward and uh, and i think uh, we always uh, try to explore the opportunities and uh, uh, I think 18 years back I visited South Africa and uh, Botswana to explore the market opportunities, not the investment to be yes. very honest. So so we, we always try to explore. Right? As I told, there are three kind of uh, opportunities always there and whatever is suitable, the businessman always uh, look for where is they will get the profit, they will get the benefit, they will get, get more comfort they will certainly go there. And so it is up to Ghana uh, structure uh, how they can offer not only Bangladeshis that other part of the world's investment and uh, and uh, other other kind of collaboration sure. and not only not only investment that there, there can be Bangladesh has huge experience to grow because uh, it's a very uh, you know, very low income country once up in time we, we an economy develop I personally believe mainly based on the government's industry success. So I, I, I personally believe. So uh, Bangladesh can be a good example for 
Ghana. So sharing experience for Ghana also even very important, not only the investment, that other experience also, I, I believe it will be invaluable. No, exactly. It, it, uh, uh, as, I, as I said, that uh, we, we are looking for growth and we had the growth for last two decades. So next 10, ten years, we, we certainly would, would like to continue the growth and uh, to ensure the growth is uh, not not being hampered so that is and to expand the market to expand the other opportunities explore the other opportunities as i, as I earlier mentioned that having uh, uh, investment in other countries joint venture and other kind of collaboration whatever the opportunities it is uh, it is the beginning so i think that there are a lot of opportunities and you have to you have to study it you have to analyze it you have to you know, uh, uh, make the uh, proper judgment that what could be the best option for you. Thank you.